just want to make sure that we uh, recognize all these tremendous uh, leaders, and among them is Grace Diaz. Speaker was very conscious of the fact that uh, one of his most uh, gifted members has to be recognized. So thank you, Mr. Speaker, for that. Now I, I'd like to call on uh, Belinda Philippe, the One Neighborhood Village Director of Programs and Operations. Well, on behalf of One Neighborhood Builders and our Executive Director, Jen Hawkins, welcome. We, we are truly honored to be able to host the U.S. Senator Jack Reed, Governor McKee, Lieutenant Governor uh, Sabina Matos, our House Speaker Shikarchi, uh, Senate, Senator McCall, Rhode Island Housing's Christine Hus um, Hunsinger and uh, Providence Housing's Jackie Martinez. Thank you so much uh, for coming by today. Representative Diaz, Representative uh, Blazajewski, I'm sorry about that. Um, so as mentioned, first and foremost, Senator Reed, we are so grateful for your leadership and for the commitment and dedication from our entire congressional delegation as you have advocated for rental assistance for Rhode Islanders. You know and understand so well how crucial it is that we help residents stay in their homes through these challenging times. To Governor McKee, Lieutenant Governor Matos, Speaker Shikarchi, Representative Diaz, Representative Blazajewski, and Senator Coleman, thank you so much for working diligently every day on behalf of Rhode Island residents and businesses to ensure that we all move forward to eradicate systemic barriers that lead to health disparities. We appreciate your focus on housing and on building a Rhode Island that works for all. To our partners, Rhode Island Housing and Providence Housing Authority, thank you again. We all recognize that we are stronger together. As we collaborate to bring this rent relief money to as many qualified Rhode Islanders as possible, we are grateful for our community partners. We know that we can count on you and that you can always count on One Neighborhood Builders as well. For those of you who don't know who One Neighborhood Builders are, we are a nonprofit community development leader committed to developing affordable housing and engaging neighbors across greater Providence to cultivate healthy, vibrant, and safe communities. So again, we welcome you to our home, and we are pleased to welcome you at a time when volunteers are participating in the Juneteenth activities today here in our neighborhoods. We are out with our community health workers uh, providing vaccinations uh, to the community, and we are here today. So this really marks the Juneteenth uh, celebration, and especially since it's our first federal holiday. So. Yes, a round of applause for that. We would just like to take the opportunity and we want everyone across Rhode Island to know that we are here to help residents access the rent relief to which they are entitled to. We have assembled a strong team dedicated to helping people complete the rent relief application. One Neighborhood Builders knows how this program works and with our partners, the Refugee Dream Center, in Amor, and other subgrantees around uh, the state who have been called and entrusted to do this work, we are poised to help in multiple languages as well. I'll give you a quick example because as we hear all that's going on, to bring it home, we tell you that there, is a, there was a family, who a very young family, who had a... Uh, a one and a half year old child and the mother is expecting. Due to health complications, 
she had to stop working uh, during the COVID season. And then unfortunately, her husband was also unemployed. So they were struggling with uh, some health, some housing burdens and uh, financial struggles, insecure about their housing. So we reached out also to their landlord uh, to explain the program and see if, uh, if she would cooperate. It was an elderly woman who did not speak English. So to make matters com uh, even further complicated, and she had no technology access, and we were trying to figure out how we're gonna get this done, but this was a prime example how we all win because the family was not placed at a, um, a burden, the family was able to apply, and we were able to assist in another language with the landlord, and we were also able to help her collect the documents that she needed and also in the technology to upload it all. So I think that was a win-win for Rhode Island, all of Rhode Island, not just for the family and this um, homeowner. So we know firsthand how much people are struggling economically and how much they need this help. That is why residents can walk into our office and make an appointment or call us for help. Our doors have been open uh, to, to those seeking rental relief for only five weeks, but our team has already started applications for more than 150 neighbors. This outreach is so vital because helping families stay in their homes means that their children can remain in the same school from one month to the next. Helping individuals pay their rent means stability so that they can focus on working, living, and getting through day to day. Day to day challenges that we have all faced since this pandemic began. So we are here to help and we are grateful to everyone everyone who has helped us to make this a reality and to make this program available so that we can help the families most in need in all of Rhode Islanders. Thank you once again.